Tennessee company is purchasing Three Valley Funeral Homes, and a documentary on Youngstown will get a hometown screening this weekend. This is The Daily Buzz. Hello everyone, welcome to The Daily Buzz. I'm Mike Moliterno. What a weekend for sports. Between everything that happened on Saturday and last night's Guardians game, I am pretty tired. So let's get into what's coming up for the week of October 17th. This afternoon, there will be a press conference with Helen Lafferty, who will become the interim president at Youngstown State University when President Jim Tressel steps down in February. Lafferty will discuss her priorities for the university and how she'll guide the college as it transitions to a new president. Check back to businessjournaldaily.com tomorrow for that story. Tuesday morning, the Mahoning County Career and Technical Center will hold a groundbreaking for the Innovative Energy and Technology Workforce Training Center. The $1.1 million project will be in a adaptable hub of technology training for MCCTC High School, Adult Career Center, and Valley STEM students. On Thursday, the Columbiana County Agricultural Career Expo will take place at the Columbiana County Fairgrounds from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. The expo is open to all Columbiana County School District freshmen and sophomores. And on Friday at 7.30 a.m., the Youngstown Warren Regional Chamber will host Good Morning Niles at the Eastwood Event Center. Attendees will hear from Niles Mayor Steve Mankiewicz, Mahoning Valley Scrapper General Manager Jordan Taylor and from William Kramer and Sons Inc. and Cadence Care Network, winners of the Business Pride and Community Spirit Pride Awards. Now here's some of what you might have missed while you were watching sports over the weekend. Tennessee-based Heritage Family Funeral Services is in the process of purchasing three Mahoning Valley Funeral Service providers. The sale is expected to close by the end of the year, according to a statement drafted by the principals of Lane Family Funeral Homes, Bumgarner Funeral Homes, and Becker Funeral Homes. And The Place That Makes Us, a documentary about Youngstown residents who decided to stay and make their city a better place, will be screened at the Youngstown Playhouse this Saturday at 7 p.m. A panel discussion will take place after the screening, featuring several community stakeholders and the creator of the documentary, Carla Murthy. You can read more on these stories at businessjournaldaily.com. And that is going to do it for today's Daily Buzz. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. If you'd like to dive deeper into any of these stories, links are available in the description. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Mike Moliterno. 717 Credit Union business services designed to meet your daily needs. Commercial loans, business deposits, merchant and payroll services. 717 Credit Union, it's knowing you were treated right every time.